Greetings, Pastor Mike here from Community Congregational Church, Southern Pines, North Carolina. Luckily, I got my hair cut yesterday, or this video would really be a mess, but I just rolled out of bed, and I have a question for you. What's the first thing you do when you get up in the morning? Now, don't anybody answer that for real, but what's your first thought? What is your, how do you start your day? Do, is our first thought, get to that coffee machine? Or even worse, is our first thought checking our email or pulling our phone out? Is it is it hunger? Do we do we race to get something to eat? I think you see where I'm going with this. The first thing we need to do is be thankful. We need to wake up and thank God for another day, another opportunity. Psalm 30 says. Sing praises to the Lord, O you faithful ones, and give thanks to his holy name. For his anger is but for a moment, his favor is for a lifetime. Weeping may linger for the night, but joy comes in the morning. It might have even been uh, the video Coach Metzger did, but I think he said about if you wear if you wear slippers around the house, you should put them way under your bed so that every morning you'd have to start the day on your knees. Be thankful. Be thankful for each new day, for each opportunity that we have. You know, we're not that that's interesting that song. I didn't think about verse five, it says, For his anger is but for a moment. So that does God get angry with us? So um, I don't know about you, but I'm sure he gets angry with me once in a while. But let's, years ago, years ago I had this idea where I would do that. The first thing I would do is say thanks. And uh, I'm not saying that that made everything, all my problems go away and all of a sudden everything is great. But it got better. My attitude got better. Um, you know, if we're, if we're thankful for the opportunity and, and, be, and in our prayers, thank God for the, the challenges that are going to be there for us, our whole attitude will be better. And, uh, and quite honestly, I think the day will go better. So let's, let's, no matter what your answer was, if it was coffee, I understand. But let's see if we can bump coffee or whatever your answer was to second. Let's be thankful. Let's, let's thank God first. Let's go to him in a word of prayer. Gracious God, we thank you and praise you for each new morning. And uh, Lord, help us to greet each day with, the, with, the, with an attitude of thanksgiving, with a, an excitement about the opportunity that lies in the day, even if we know it's going to be a rough day. Uh, we thank you for the challenges that are there because those challenges shape us, they form us, they make us who we are. And so we give you thanks for that. And Lord, you tell us to pray without ceasing. Well, we, we know we can't seriously do that, but we can have an attitude of thanksgiving. And if we start our day in prayer, we'll be more apt to be closer to what you want us to be. So help, excuse me, help us to do just that. Help us to be thankful each and every day. Uh, and to start that in the morning is the greatest thing. In Jesus' precious name we pray. Amen. Yeah, this is this is it. I, I just got right up with this idea and, and wanted to do this video. So this seriously is my breakfast. Um, as I said, luckily I got my hair cut yesterday. So if I wouldn't have, it would be like this somehow. Maybe it is all right. I don't know. I didn't even look. I seriously didn't even look. <laughs> but... Uh, so don't anybody comment that I should have looked. That'll hurt my feelings. But uh, we're going to keep doing these uh, until things are normal, if that ever comes back. And uh, so stay safe, stay healthy. Love you.